am Hanna Østervik. I'm a Norwegian writer and uh, I just had my third novel coming out at Karl Rauf Verlag. It's called Die Zeit, die es dauert, in Norwegian, Tiden det tar, the time it takes. Uh, it's a novel that takes place the last week before Christmas. It's Signe, the main protagonist. Uh, she's 30 years old, she has her own family. And then her mother, brother uh, and father are coming with a pre-Christmas visit and the conflict is will you come home for Christmas and for the first time in Signe's life she and her new little family has decided to say no that they want to have Christmas on their own. This is the third book of three novels that uh, Karl Rau Verlag uh, recently has published, of, um, translated and published of mine, of mine, and the first of these three is called Liebe, Kjærlighet in Norwegian, Love, uh, uh, and the second one is called Så var vi ikke virkelig bin in Norwegian, Like sant som jeg er virkelig. Um, and I think these three novels are linked together in the way that uh, in Liebe uh, there is a, a nine-year-old son, uh, Jon, who's living together with his mother. Uh, and in the next one, so var vi wirklich bin? It's Johanna, she, she's 19, 20 years old, living with her mother. So it's a nine-year-old, a 19, 20 year old, and then a 30 year old. Uh, and 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 what what is kind of uh, moving on between these novels is, or kind of, each of them are, are, are working with uh, the child who is, uh, how a child kind of lives with an emptiness when it's not really seen and mirrored by, by the parent, how it becomes like a lack of an eye uh, in the child, and then as a 19, 20 year old, and then as a 30 year old, and how do you live your life if you don't have, uh, if there is emptiness where the I should have been. And the third book, the Zeit, die es dauert, kind of finishes this kind of uh, theology by uh, Signe saying, no, I will not come home for Christmas. So that marks a limit uh, and finished just in a way the bow of these three linked together. I think all my novels are uh, start with some kind of image, an inner image that I have, and then uh, I go on to to gather uh, gather what I see are kind of you know threads that go together for a long time and, and, and then in the end I have this cluster of images and, and questions and then I just start to write and I have this extremely faith that uh, my intuition will nourish me with what I need for this exploration to become fulfilled. <laughs>